Hi everyone, my name's Juliet and today I'm going to talk about how you get a table of contents in your ebook in Scrivener. If you were creating an ebook in Microsoft Word, you'd have to physically generate a table of contents. But you don't have to do that in Scrivener because there are certain presets set into the software. These presets depend on which template you've selected so you do need to make sure that you select the right one. As you can see, there are several available for fiction, non-fiction and various other types of writing. This is for the basic novel fiction template, which assumes that everything in your folders is a scene or a section and the folders themselves are the actual chapters. So it only uses those as the contents. You did know that Scrivener used the titles of your folders as the contents, didn't you? Well, you do now. But there is one other thing you have to be careful about. The preset assumes that you basically want two titles. One that says chapter, number, whatever, and one that is an actual title. Obviously, in a lot of books, this isn't the case. You just want to say chapter one, chapter two, chapter three. If you want that and you don't do this one thing, this is what you're going to end up with in your contents page and text. So to make sure that you only get that one title, we need to go into the compile function and select formatting. Then you need to highlight the level one folder. And below that, you'll see the layout for that section. And you can see there that it has a chapter and a title. To get rid of the extra chapter, go into section layout and remove the code that's there that says prefix. Once you've done that and saved it, compiling your file will generate something more like this. Only one title. Yes, I know the formatting isn't great, We'll deal with that in a future video. So that's Scrivener's automatic generation of a table of contents in a fiction novel template. For more Scrivener videos, why not check out this playlist? I'll see you there. Thank you for watching.